of a long time, Lenore County schools teacher is charged with simple assault following an incident in the classroom. Let's get right to News Channel 12's Tyler Harden, who's following the latest in the Live Center. Val, late this afternoon, Lenore County deputies charged 71 year old Patricia Graham with multiple counts of simple assault on two students at South Lenore High School. Investigators say the incident happened yesterday. In a moment, we're going to show you the video, which was uploaded publicly to Facebook. We have blurred the students' faces, and keep in mind, this is a glimpse of what happened. We do not know what happened before or after this was taken. But in the nine second video, five seconds shows what deputies say they saw in the video. That's Graham hitting two students with an extension cord who were on the floor. In the first second, as it comes into focus, the video shows Graham pull the cord back and strike a student in a blue sweatshirt. That student then gets up and moves away. Three seconds into the video shows Graham making another strike at a student in a black shirt. Deputies say a school resource officer was made aware of what happened around 1.30 yesterday afternoon. They reviewed the video and took it to the district attorney's office. Deputies took out simple assault charges against Graham today. Lenore County Sheriff Jackie Rogers tells me he was disturbed after watching the video. We just not going to tolerate that activity happening from uh, people with authority in our schools. It was, it was kind of mind blowing to see it happen and, and to see it, how it occurred and uh, it deeply disturbed me. And tonight we've reached out to the school system about the incident. A spokesperson released this statement in part, quote, the teacher is no longer employed by Lenore County Public Schools. LCPS considers this a personnel matter and will have no further comment. Now school officials say they've spoken with both students parents. Sheriff Rogers says Graham does not have any criminal history with the sheriff's office and head at six his message to parents who have school who, school children in that system.